I like this problem a lot. It's solving rational equations. The reason I like this so much is there is no solution to this. There is no value of X you can plug into this to make it true. So let's talk about why. First, we got to look at the denominator. We know that we cannot do division by zero. So we have to say that X minus five cannot equal zero. Then we're going to add five to both sides. So that's going to mean that X cannot equal five. And we'll just bring that over here and we'll put a box around it. That's a domain restriction. You always want to do that for the first step of these. Next, let's copy this down and put parentheses on both sides. And we're going to multiply both sides by X minus five five over one. So on the left hand side, it's going to distribute to the first term, which is going to give us this right here, this times the first term plus, and then it's going to distribute to the second term. So it's going to be this right here, this X minus five times the one, and that's all going to be equal to just this side as it is. So for this first one, this X minus five cancels with this X minus five, and it just gives us X plus four. And then for the second one, there's nothing to cancel with the X minus five. So it ends up being X times one minus five times one, which is X minus five. And then on the right hand side, this X minus five on top will cancel with the X minus five on bottom, which is going to leave us with just a nine. We're going to simplify this by combining like terms. X plus X is equal to two X. Four minus five is equal to negative one. And then we're just going to bring down the nine. So our goal is get X by itself. So we're going to add one to both sides. These cancel each other out, giving us just two X on the left hand side. And then nine plus one is equal to 10. Then we're going to divide by two. Two X divided by two is X and 10 divided by two is five. But we end up with X equals five. But if you remember our domain restriction from the very beginning, X cannot equal five. So X equals five is not a valid solution. So the answer to this is no solution. There is no solution to this equation right here. How exciting.